So uh, you're a guy, you're a guy, you're gay, and you're in love with a guy, with another man, and you'd like to know if he is in love, in love with you too. Um, this interactive tarot reading uh, gives you the answer. You have three choices. It's the Russian Tarot of St. Petersburg, the Mini Rider White, and the Pictorial Key Tarot. So you pick option A, option B, or option C. And this will give you the answer. So pick now option A, option B, or option C. So you've picked option A, which is the Russian Tarot of St. Petersburg. I oh, know I don't know if you can see it. Anyway, what is the answer? Does he love you? You're a guy, you're in love with a guy, and you'd like to know if he loves you. So what do you have? We have the three of clubs, the four of swords, and the eight of clubs. Well, this isn't exactly uh, a reading that speaks about feelings and emotions. It's more, it speaks more of um, uh, fire type of energy, which is the clubs. Um, I think you're contemplating it, you're thinking about the guy, you know, you're thinking about him a lot. You're thinking of maybe approaching him, starting a relationship. And he may might be oblivious. He doesn't even know that you like him. Um, or let's, let's see, he, he, he might be, I don't know, a very... Uh, uh, the type of person who doesn't take initiative, kind of sits around and waits for someone else to approach him or he might be you know even sick sometimes that happens but I, the, the feeling that I got is that you you are thinking about it you're contemplating it, contemplating approaching him he doesn't know about it and something will happen in your relationship extremely fast if he loves you if he doesn't love you I really don't know the, the cards don't don't seem to say anything about feelings in love. If I pick another card, what will be the result? It's the chariot. It's number seven. The chariot kind of tells me that you might be involved in a very physical relationship, which again tells me the same with the three of clubs and the eight of clubs. Doesn't really speak of emotions and feelings and love and affection. It's more like fire type of energy, like it's fun, it's fun uh, to be with each other. So you might be in a relationship, you might approach him, but in terms of feelings, I have no idea. It might be the type of relationship that won't last all that long, it will be just for fun. Okay, so here's your answer. So this is option B, does he love you? This is the mini. Rider white tarot, very cute. Oops, and we have the Knight of Pentacles or the Knight of Coins. We have the Eight of Swords, and we have the the Two of Wands. This doesn't right. Does he love you? Again, this is not a very emotional type of reading all all that's in, in this reading the second one the option B there's a lot of uh, air type of energy like rational and logical type of energy there's a lot of there's a, a fire and there's earth type of energy feelings are connected with water and water in tarot is represented by the cups so I think you might be the Knight of, of Pentacles or the Knight of Coins and you might be like in your 30s 
and you might belong to a earth sign like Virgo, uh, Capricorn or Taurus and you might be a very diligent and practical sort of fellow and very modest, uh, very low profile and when you give your heart or your commitment to someone it's thinking on the long, long term goal it's like you are here to stay, you are here to um, it, it's not something that you do lightly uh, but I, I don't sense a lot of uh, affection or a uh, love energy which it's or a lot of emotion it's it's a different type of commitment it's practical commitment and the person that you might like might be represented by the eight of swords this might be someone who, who worries too much worries 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 someone who feels like a victim someone who doesn't help himself uh, someone who self sabotages all the time and you might be offering something commitment to someone who is, una is unable to see what you are offering so I don't know he even knows the truth about himself because he's like he's, he's blind to himself and he, uh, he, he has a lot of fears and he doesn't seem to be able to come out from those fears and the final card is like the two of wands which usually represents someone who wants kind of to take over the world or something like that it's like it tells me this one connects with the knight of, of, of coins that doesn't matter what the guy thinks or how he is you still want to conquer him you still want to uh, you still want to be with him you still it's kind of a bit this card is connected with with ubris it's kind of bit it's a bit arrogant uh, like you don't care about how he feels and thinks you just want to be with him in, in, in I don't think you like even contemplating uh, his, his personality you just just want you you want him um, I don't I don't know I don't think uh, uh, he even knows if he loves you or not but something tells me that you might not love him as well you might you want like almost to conquer him to, to have a commitment um, for the sake of commitment but I don't think this is love or affection I'm sorry so you've picked option C which is the pictorial key tarot deck Huh? and this is your answer does he love you we have the knave I think it's called the knave of cups and then we have the ace of swords and then we have the ten of coins I would say yes yes he loves you uh, I think he's a young man he might be younger, younger than you he might belong to the sign of Pisces, Scorpio uh, or Cancer or might have these signs prominent in his natal, natal astrological chart and because this is a cup uh, card uh, it, it speaks to me about affection I think he loves you yes I think he will be the one who will uh, have the uh, will talk to you will speak to you this is the ace of swords we will have uh, so swords it's about uh, air signs air signs are connected to communication so he will approach you I think or he even will will be the one who initiates this relationship and this relationship as uh, as the ability or as might develop into a very long term relationship this is like the family card you see you see the ten of coins right there's the guy 
and then the wife and the children or like the children and the uh, the grandkids this is like very happy long term type of card like the family the family has been formed and is uh, stable and it's long term so you might even introduce this guy to your parents to your family or you might form a family with with this this young man and it might be a very type uh, of stable family someone you might marry even so congratulations thank you very much for watching